Model railroad engines today have many capabilities only dreamed of in the old days. Digital command control allows for moldable engines to be controlled or interfaced to a computer. Sound decoders can be added to the steam engines that will shuff, ring bells, blow whistles, and more. With CTI electronic control module, modules with train brain software and your old computer, you have the programming flexibility to manage a model railroad. I have automated many of the functions of my EPNSW model railroad using CTI software. This video would describe automating point-to-point -point and continuous train routing. You may find other videos of the EPNSW in, in action on YouTube. With the click of a mouse, switches can be directed or engines can be selected to begin or end their journey. To illustrate, the passenger train, the blue button, at the, at the Cloudcroft station can be routed down to the Alamogordo station. From the route panel, we can add another train to be run now simultaneous with the passenger train. In our demo, we will add a third train to run from Dawson to El Paso at the same time. Select the start button to begin the session. The computer will control all the engines and routes. At times, you may want to select trains to go to a destination, then return and repeat the movements continuously. You can route multiple trains to multiple destinations and then route them back again to the starting point. But be careful, you can select routes that will run, run one engine into another. Of course, you can program to avoid collisions as well. I chose to keep the operator, let the operator select any route. Keeps me alert and on my toes. The Cloudcroft station can be removed to look under the hood to see the CTI electronic modules that control the action. The Digitrex DCC controller is next to the monitor and behind two CTI sensor modules are on the fascia of the layout. Plenty of wires are connected to the sensors that run under the layout. I use both photo sensors and magnetic read sensors to keep track of the trains. Magnets are mounted under the engines as shown, and reed switches are mounted on the track. The track ties disguised to look like spilled oil. Up to 10 Atlas switches can be controlled by each Switchmaster CTI board, board shown here. Now, whether you are a one-man operation or you invite your friends over to operate DCC hand controllers, the computer is a helpful tool to keep your trains on schedule. 